Welcome to Pop Turnative, where we dive into topical discussions from the worlds of pop culture, social media, and sports. Here is your host, Peter Romoliotis, aka PD Beats. PD Beats here for Pop Turnative. Speaking to Bruce Davison about the matter part of Welcome to the Blumhouse. Thank you for doing this. Welcome for welcome to the show. Oh, it's nice to be with you on Pop Turnative. Yeah, absolutely. You are no stranger to the horror genre, sir. This is yeah. not your first rodeo. What do you like about the genre, Bruce? Oh, blood was mother's milk to me. Uh, let me see. What do I like about the genre? Um, I like working with independent filmmakers because for the most part, something happens in that uh, that um, is creative and it's not necessarily made to the same formula as everything else. Now, it's true, you know, there's a lot of uh, same horror movies made over and over again with the kids going into the haunted house and stuff. But um, I try to find stuff that's new and kind of eclectic and weird, if that's possible. And, and For sure. I think, I think this... Uh, this film is uh, is certainly got those elements in it. I think, and it bases itself on a real primal fear to start with, which yeah. is getting old and dying and withering away and being abandoned and being locked up and nobody believes you. What was the experience like filming it? Like put it like doing this film the matter. Oh well, the, it was a joy for me. Um, because I'm playing a character who is really enjoys himself. And whenever you can play a character like that, it, it's it's a kick in the head. It's, you know, the more fun you have, the better it is. And it was encouraged a great deal by Axel. And um, working with the, the, the women in it were wonderful, too. They were all just so spectacular. Does it excite you a little bit as well that, you know, you, you said, you know, you always loved horror films. I mean, the genre is just unbelievable these days, Bruce. It's just amazing. Does it excite you to see where we are right now with horror? Well, it's like, you know, uh, uh, it's just caught the wave right now, like Westerns in the 40s and the 50s, you know. The horror genre is uh, like a new Western. It's uh, gotten some wonderful possibilities. Also, we live in such an unstable time that it just we feed right into that. We, you know, our fears are so strong, and and we always like to look at our fears in a safe space, in a theater, or you know, on on the screen where we can scream and yell and know that okay, but we can still get popcorn and still <laughs> go to the bathroom. When did you notice the shift, though, where there were horror movies that were getting away a little bit from kind of the traditional tropes of horror where it was just about the jump scares and the gore. There was a shift at one point. Did you notice that shift? No, I, I see it as an evolution. It always, yeah. the things that scared me when I was young were the, uh, you know, the, the apocalypse from the atomic bomb. Uh, yeah. the, I remember the movie that scared me the most was them. Yes. And I had to look back on that and realize it scared me because I didn't know what it was and I didn't know where it was going and something was something was out there and it go wee, 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 and scared the hell out of me and uh, it really hooks you that and that little girl with the doll with the broken head walking through the desert alone in a daze saying them them but it, it, it's the unknown. Yeah, And uh, the unknown is always, you know, that can lead to the next genre, whatever. The unknown being space, you, you, you know, nobody hears you scream in space or, yeah. you know, getting old. And Absolutely. Losing your marbles and nobody believes you and you're abandoned and you're alone and it's nobody there but you and the reaper and what's happening and why can't somebody save me from this it's 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 a real palpable fear absolutely bruce thank you so much for your time to chat about welcome oh. to the blood most of the matter i really appreciate it thank you peter thank you everyone's gonna be able to see it on amazon prime thank you very much thank you for tuning in to pop turnative make sure to check out our past episodes of pop turnative on youtube be sure to like Popternative on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. 
This has been an Autograph Communications production.